Charles and Richards. I'm your host, Kyle Doherty. We're coming to you here on the 387th day of quarantine from my basement, where it's the only quiet place in my house, and it has all the booze. And my wife told me that I needed to shorten up these tutorials and be a little bit more entertaining, although she should know better after all these years of living with me. But in an effort to please my wife, as we're all trying to please our wives in this time, I'm going to give it a shot. And so today's topic, we're going to address personal style, how to develop it. But before we do that, I want to discuss my drink, as hopefully most of you are enjoying your beverage while watching this video. This is quite a simple drink. It's actually called Rusted Nail. It's a generous pour of my dear friend Aberfeldy here, which you can drink all day and not have it break the bank. And then I throw in a nice twist of orange peel to give it that refreshing taste that hopefully will be the perfect remedy to get you through this video. Now delving into today's topic, the five elements of building a personal brand. Now most of you have asked over the years that uh, you, you feel a little lost when looking at your closet, a little, a little chaotic, and so hopefully this will help bring it all together for you. When we first start, we look at the first element, obviously, the building from the basics, or starting from the basics. You have to have that foundation, just like everything in life, uh, building a quality wardrobe starts with the basics, and then you add any unique pieces as you develop your style and uh, create a well-rounded wardrobe. The second element is knowing your body. If we were all built like Ryan Reynolds, we could wear just about anything, but let's be honest, who's actually built like that? Probably not even Ryan Reynolds. The point is, you know, you need to know what fits. You need to know your body. You need to know what looks good and what doesn't. For example, I can't wear a pair of skinny jeans. It's the hardest I've ever heard my wife laugh. So you need to know what looks good on you and what doesn't. The third component is knowing your environment. There's a time and a place for everything, so you need to dress to your audience. It's not all about dressing for the role you want, but rather being comfortable in the clothes you put on to wear you can inspire the confidence that you want to portray. The fourth component is style icons. Finding cues from people that you, whose style you admire and, and pulling from those um, and, and seeing what works for you within the style that you like. And the fifth component, best of all, is you gotta own it. Now that you've got this great look you got to get out there and wear it with the confidence that it's made for. It's, it, it is your look. It's your style that you've built. And with that, that's the five basic components. Probably the shortest video I've ever produced. Again, courtesy of my wife there. If you do want to hear me ramble on, feel free to leave a comment below. Or uh, shoot us an email at Charles, Kyle at charlesandrichards.com. Um, and now that you've made it this far in the video, you do owe it to yourself to subscribe below, as we'd love to send you more amazing content from Charles and Richards. With that being said, we thank you for watching the video, and take care.